Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. It's Paul, Mike Zero, Whiskey November Uniform, or 26 Charlie Tango 730 if you catch me on 11 meters and PMR 446. Now, just a quick one I'm filming from my my uh, Oppo phone. Uh, this is a Silvercrest radio that I picked up from the local Lidl. Uh, it was on reduced to clear, so it doesn't mean that you'll actually be able to just go into Lidl and get this. Um, there's no guarantee that there'll be any in stock at other little stores. Uh, there was at the um, uh, Catrick Garrison store, or technically Colburn store, because that's where it's actually located. So it's a shortwave receiver that can cover some of the amateur bands. However, because it's an AM receiver, you wouldn't be able to um, uh, listen to any voice transmissions on, on the amateur bands, because they tend to be in uh, lower sideband for the majority of the ones that are covered. Um, yeah, it's 40, I think it'll do do 60 metres as well, although I've not actually um, uh, had a proper look. Uh, while I was tuning around on the 40 metre band, I did pick out some FT8. It um, should be still on 40 metres, actually. Yeah, it is. So, so it's just a... Uh, just a normal radio receiver that's capable of receiving shortwave bands, but there's not that many shortwave broadcast stations out there that I don't think are still transmitting using analog AM. Try and hold this a bit steadier so it's not shaking about a bit. And yeah, so, so it's only AM, it won't do SSB, but I was able to pick out some FT8 because I don't think you really need to be actually using SSB to, to receive that. Though you do use SSB to transmit that, if I recall. Although I've not actually used uh, FT8 before. So, it was less than £12, I believe, for that. So, it was reduced, as I said. Uh, I don't know what the model number of the radio is, because I don't think it's got one. It just says on the box, uh, shortwave radio, or something to that effect. Um, it comes with a 5.9 volt power adapter, which is a bit interesting. It takes uh, four AA batteries as well, which do tally up to six volts, so a six volt power supply would have been perfectly adequate. So, yeah, it's just a quick look at it. I'll do a proper look at it uh, at another time, because I don't usually cover the shortwave listeners or shortwave receivers like this on the channel, but this is just something a little different. Uh, so, yeah, um, so keep yourself safe, guys. We're in the middle of the lockdown still. I haven't really had time to do any content. I've been busy with work. And unfortunately, I'm in for overtime the day after filming this. So I might not be able to get anything up, which is a bit annoying. So, yeah, turn for you guys. Keep yourself safe. Uh, I am on the air sometimes. Uh, just, just also um, uh, watch out for the virus, as you know. Uh, it's still out there. So, and I uh, have fun playing radio. And... I uh, hope to speak to you on the air or or even uh, get another video up, hopefully soon. And yeah, so that's 7 for now, guys.